I hope that the focus of debates on this act will not be dragged into too much heated arguments on homosexual activities under section 377A. In my view, the government's status quo stand on homosexual activities under section 377A is for the benefit of society as a whole. The fact is, even though our country is open and receptive to changes and diversity, our society's majority view is still conservative in many aspects of life. But I concede that current points of view, especially among youth, is changing to a more progressive one. Homosexual activities, although undoubtedly exist, is still considered a lifestyle outside the mainstream society. From a secular view, it's a personal thing, and I feel it is good to leave it as such. But many of my constituents and Malay Muslim community leaders believe that by making the activity not considered as an offence, it can be seen as an endorsement or support. And this will divide society. They believe the government will make the appropriate decision that will reflect our social situation in Singapore. And this includes the consideration for the petition presented by NMP Siu Kam Hong in Parliament. I feel we should not make the issue a big one and let us look at the penal code amendments from a bigger perspective and for the benefit of the majority of Singaporeans.